Hello everybody. So I've gotten the question a handful of times, whether it's how do you double gun? How do you double gun so well? How do you animation cancel? Which, if you don't know, animation canceling is one of the big reasons why people can do the double gunning so fast. So I figured I would just make a video explaining it the best I can so that I don't in the future explain it some way else or explain it worse or explain it better. So just cut out all the confusion, put it in one video, explain it one way the best I can. So I will be explaining what animation canceling is, how it is people do it so well. I'll be giving tips, tricks, going through the motion slowly, trying to explain it the best I can. So in the background, you'll be seeing some of my clips and some of the clips that were sent in to me by one of my good friends, Vin. So thank you very much to him. It helps a lot with making this video. And like I just said, I will try to make this an easy learning experience, going through the motion slowly and explaining it the best I can. So the basic mechanic for double gunning goes like such. You're just gonna want to aim shoot, swap your weapon, however you do that, whether it's scroll wheel, one or two, some other binded button. After you do that, you're going to want to sprint. That's the animation cancel. Then you're going to aim, and then shoot again. So it is aim, shoot, sp swap guns, sprint, aim, and then shoot again. Just like that. Aim, shoot, swap, sprint, aim, shoot. When you're first learning, trust me, when you're first learning, go slow. If you try to do it super fast like everyone else, you're going to start um, having gun jams, which is basically trying to shoot before your gun actually finishes its animation. Without animation cancel, this is what it looks like. And with animation cancel, it looks like that. So it's not drastically faster to where it's, if you're not using it, then you're screwed, which in most cases you won't be. But if you're fighting another super sweaty crew that is using animation canceling, shooting faster than you, then you're going to want to get that down. And as you saw just there, I tried to do it a little bit too quick, and I got gun jam, so my gun just didn't shoot. Because like I said earlier, doing it too quick, you're doing it. Be you're trying to shoot before your gun finishes its animation, or before the game inputs being able to shoot. And then nothing will happen, and you will have a bad day. Some of the things I like to do when I am double gunning, and a lot of people do it as well, is obviously trying to keep your movements sporadic and different. I know a lot of people say to never jump. I like to, it's just a habit. A lot of people will say don't do it because it's predictable. But I've gotten so used to it that I can't help it anymore. In between shots, doing the animation cancel. So during the sprint, I like to put like bring my mouse left and right, and then hold A and D. So I go left, left and right, side to side, and then look side to side as well. While sprinting and moving forward, just kind of throws your hitbox around a little bit, makes it harder to hit you. For some tips, I know I asked Vin what his main tip would be, and he said to be confident with your shots. So if you see someone, don't get all nervous because it's your first time double gunning. Um, just take a shot normally. If you don't get the animation cancel perfectly, you'll be okay. Take your time. Calm down. Just take a shot when you get a chance. I 100% agree with Ben on this one. You definitely need to be confident because if you're not and you get all nervous and, or excited, you try to do it too quick, your guns will jam, you'll try to do it too fast and nothing will work. It happens to me all the time. And I know it happens to other people as well. And to add on to that, 
yes, be confident with your shots, for sure. Also, going back to trying not to worry about doing it too quick, because if you do it too quick, and you're not worrying about where you're shooting, it's not really going to help you now, is it? So be confident and actually take your time to aim and hit your shot. So if you're just trying to do it quick, but you don't hit anything, that doesn't help you. And you're stuck reloading both your guns. I know sometimes it helps to hold down your aim button when you're swapping. Just hold down your aim button the entire time. Sometimes that helps. If I'm having a bad day, and I'll, I'll try that. Sometimes it'll work for me better. Sometimes I'll just on ADS and then ADS when we need to again. Now to go over this again, very simple. Take your time to learn this mechanic. Just shoot, swap, sprint, aim, shoot. Practice that the best you can. Whenever you're sailing around the seas, as you got some downtime, just run around shooting stuff. Practicing your double gun. I know that's what I do, that's what most of my crew does whenever running around doing nothing. Just shoot, practice, you'll get better, trust me. It's confusing at first, I understand that. But once you get it, it'll become super satisfying when you get that two tap or when you finally get that ski. Once you start to get this mechanic down, it'll become a lot easier when you finally realize like, oh, this is actually a lot easier than it seems. And you practice more, you'll be able to start adding in some movement into it, trying to be a little bit more tricky and unpredictable. So let's do a little recap here. Again. Because this is the most important part of everything when it comes to double gunning. Aim, shoot, swap, sprint, aim, shoot. It's as easy as that. The thing that trips everyone up is trying to do it too quickly. And the tips. Be confident with your shots. Take your time. Don't try to go too fast to where you're aiming at nothing and you're just wasting bullets. So make sure you're aiming where you actually want to shoot before you try doing it too quick. It takes a lot of practice, it takes a lot of time, you will get there. Practice the most if you like if you if you do insider and you have to go do your insider hour for the week. I know I do this, I know Vin does this, I'm pretty sure one of my other buddies does this as well. You sit there for the hour just shooting at the mast. And Pretending you're in certain scenarios, just shooting around at nothing. But trust me, it helps a lot. A lot of repetition. If it helps you, ADS the entire time. Just hold down the uh, either right click or your right trigger on the controller. Because yes, you can do this on controller. A lot of people say this is a PC only mechanic that is complete bullshit. Trust me, I've seen plenty of P uh, uh, console players or just controller users double gun better than, I, better than I do. So don't listen to people that say if you use controller you can't do it because that is complete bullshit. Yes, you can. Well, I hope this helped you. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. I'll do my best to answer them all. So yeah, thank you for watching. If you have questions, like I said, put them in the comments. I will put my Discord in the description as well. You can add me, DM me, if you have any more questions that you don't just want to put in the comments. Um, I will most likely respond to you in Discord. It's really easy. So yeah, thank you again for watching. I hope this helped. Be sure to let me know what you thought, and see you next time.